my dear friends we are discussing the amazing concept of uh, neuro linguistic programming uh, in short called nlp as i explained to you let us drop all the jargons let us not talk about nlp let us talk about common sense what is the purpose of our living isn't it to cherish relationship isn't it to do something worthwhile to create an outcome in life and once we accept that we have to create certain outcomes in life the next common sense principle is we are also responsible for the goodwill for the cooperation of others without the help of others without an element of leadership skill without an element of team building can we achieve something i keep saying and i have said this in these episodes the higher up you go in your career you need to deal more of people issues than of technical issues if you have to deal with people issues you should understand the chemistry of relationship you should know the finer aspects of communication the finer aspects of interpersonal relationship from that point of view there are many things which you should know and one such thing is the basic principles we have been discussing under the head neuro linguistic programming in the last episode we discussed how experience has a structure that presupposition is useful in my 40 years of um, career i have had several people who were my bosses and luckily every one of them molded me to what i am today when i started going deeper into nlp i started doing a backward integration to relate some of my experiences with some of my bosses for example i remember an executive director of a company who is my role model in relationship building in exhibiting a sense of concern he is a people builder when i read this uh, nlp presupposition nlp uh, is about relationship and experience as a structure i recall with what esteem he is held even today by some of the people with whom um, he had worked i have been the head of personnel in the same company where he was the executive director even to even today he is so the union will come to me with a demand or an operator will come to me with a request which i know it's not possible for him to get it but he will be very keen that he should meet the executive director then i said go meet him and he will go there and after an hour or so he will come to me and then say sir he has not acceded to my request but he listened to me he gave such a patient listening hearing to my grievances to my demand i am not happy that i have not got i have not got my request acceded but still i am convinced why he is not able to do that the whole difference is the experience that he undergoes while interacting with that person that's why i keep saying your eye contact is very important your facial expression is very important the words that you use are very very important 
your understanding your quality of listening is very very important it is not whether you agree or disagree it is not a question of whether you are accepting or opposing it's a question of what quality of relationship that you are maintaining in that very moment it is not likely it is impossible that every time you say yes to everything you have to say no and saying no has to be done in such a way that the no is accepted next time when you meet people evaluate the quality of your relationship with that person and find out with whom your experience is the highest this presupposition experience has a structure is very very important when you start occupying higher positions in life people look at you not as a human being alone but as a human being of all the presuppositions this processing of experience and this nlp presupposition of experience as a structure is very very important see you tomorrow